I wrote a story in the Women on Fire book about the shame and guilt I felt surrounding my brother's suicide. He was a drug addict from the time he was 16. He had a very tumultuous life, and it was an unknown thing. I mean, we had a stable family life, and the what in my mind had always been someone who I would envision as a drug addict, I mean, that stereotype came crashing down. What I hope other people will learn is, I think this is a national epidemic. I think that, you know, my brother was an addict. He went through rehabs until finally one day, he, they sent him to prison and that is where he took his life. Uh, it's not a discussion in our society and it's a very isolating feeling and you feel like no one else understands and I do understand and I know now talking about it I've encountered numerous people who also understand and there are many of us out here whether you're dealing with the, just the roller coaster of what addiction brings to your child's life, your sibling's life, your own life, um, the, the shame that goes along with um, someone that you love dearly being out of control and just the emotional aspect of it. It's, you just don't have to be alone and you don't have to feel that shame. You don't have to be embarrassed to say what is, because when you do, it releases you.